hello friends in this video i am going to show you how we can add logged out page in admin side so you can see here we have here logged out link and here also we have logged out link so for that we have to create one page so i am going to create one page page name is logout.php we have to add in admin side then in logout.php we have to write session start session destroy and here we have to write script type text javascript window.location index.php index is our login page now in header you can find log so we will get at two places so here this is the first place here i am going to call logout.php and here also logout so here i am going to call logout.php and we do not require these things so i am going to remove it and in place of welcome user we are going to write welcome admin now we are going to check here here you can see welcome admin this is the logout link here also logout link i am going to click on it and you can see this is the logout done now if i am going to refresh it it should not be open so we have to check what happened why it is open session start session destroy and this page is purchase underscore report so we have to open this purchase report page yeah we forgot to add your link so let me copy this link and we have to paste here and we have to check at every play page it should be added in each and every page so let me check yeah this page is not needed demo.php we are going to remove it so no worry about it all other page we have to check yeah here also it is not available so i am going to edit in footer header not needed index not needed logout not needed here yeah it is added yeah it is added in all the pages now i am going to refresh here and you can see now you cannot open that page without login if i am going to login it then it will open but if i am going to log out then you cannot open that page in demo page uh, right now we are not added that that's why it is opening but other pages are not opening so this way you can add logout link in admin side now we are going to start user side user side is very easy because we can see we are going to use this type of same functionality so just we have to copy and paste data from admin side and we have to paste there so in next video i am going to show you how we can make admin side uh sorry how we can make user side thank you so much for watching my video if you like my video then please like it and share it thank you so much again